Barnet take on Altrincham on Tuesday night in our next National League fixture. Dean, how is the mood in the camp? Right this morning. Um, the lads are doing yoga as we speak. Um, so we've done our usual video session with the staff, debriefed the game as a staff as well. And then, um, yeah, we walked on how we can uh, how we can penetrate the game plan tomorrow uh, on the training pitch. So, yeah, it's, uh, it was bright and breezy, actually. Um, sometimes you think after conceding the way we did uh, late on on Saturday, it can linger around. That hasn't lingered around. And the last time we played, um, we played three games in six days. We managed to get seven points. So, you know, hopefully it'll be similar again over the next six days. Like you say, we've got three games over the next week. Do any preparations change, or is it just business as usual? No, just business as usual. We'll always pre uh, prepare professionally and, uh, and, and uh, to our beliefs. Um, we're going up against a, t a good side tomorrow. Good combinations and wide areas, altering them. Um, very well coached team. Very good with the ball. Um, he probably hasn't got it exactly where he wants it now, Parky. Um, looking at his team, um, he's, he, he, they've improved as the season's gone on so it's going to be a tough game um, but we're prepared like we always do um, and uh, we're looking forward to it it's a great challenge they are struggling in form Altrincham of late does that cause more of an issue for us than if they were in good form there's no easy games in the division you know you watched yesterday you watched Derby against Torquay you look at all the National League sides that are still in the FA Cup competition this is a tough tough division if not one of the toughest um, you know so it, they're a good side Altrincham I watched them beat all the shot uh, last week, a fair game against Wheelstone. There wasn't a lot in the game. Uh, Wheelstone managed to get on top within that result. Um, but the way they play their philosophy is, is very technical. Um, like I say, combinations and weird areas very well. Cole Clough's a top player for the division as well. So they've got some good players and a, and a good young manager as well. So, um, yeah, but we're, we're, we've got some good players as well. So we've got to go there. And uh, we've done all right on the road of late, to be fair to us. We did really well at Bromley. So, yeah, looking forward to it. And finally, is there any updated team news ahead of tomorrow's game? Uh, same squad as Saturday, um, basically. So, Musa has trained this morning. Whether we include him or not, I'm not sure. Um, so, that's a positive. Realistically, he's been out so long, we probably won't include him in the squad. Um, he needs to get at least a couple of weeks training under his belt. Um, and hopefully, he get through that. But, uh, same squad, yeah. Uh, will we make some changes to the team? Possibly. Um, with the, with the volume of games, so whoever comes into the team, we trust, we believe in, and uh, hopefully they can do their best. Dean, thanks for your time, and all the best for tomorrow.